I'm country just cause I live. I'm country cause I drive a big truck. I'm country cause I got a belt buckle and a cowboy hat. I'm tired of hearing people say they're country and drive around in a squatted truck listening to Dan and Shake. Like, Bubby, I hate to tell you, but you ain't got nothing on this back road street cred here. You ain't never been, uh, ain't never been cow tipping. You ain't never rode a back road at three o'clock drunker than fuck. Uh, I hate to tell you, Bubby, but you ain't country just cause you own a cowboy hat and a pair of Wrangler jeans. I'm all the time seeing on Tick Me Me Talk all these fake country boys saying that saying that they more country than somebody. Hey, hey, you know how you gonna be more country than somebody, Bubby? I hate, you can't just be more country than somebody. I mean, just cause somebody was born up in fucking Illinois in the cornfield doesn't make them any more country or any less country than me born in the fucking southeastern hills of Kentucky. Like, I hate to tell you, but if you, if you can respect some Hank, some Willie, and some Waylon. I mean, you country. I mean, you country. If you get down with some Hank, some Willie, and some fucking Waylon, <laughs> and if you can respect a truck being lifted up, hell, if you just you res I respect your truck, any kind of truck. You do, you do your truck how you want to. <laughs> I, I will say it. Squatted trucks are pretty gay. But. It's your truck. Your money. Do whatever the fuck you want to with it. But don't be going around saying you more country than somebody. Because I hate to tell you, but with you ain't nobody better than nobody. And ain't nobody worse than nobody. And just because you own more boots. Own more cowboy hats. Don't make you more country. Now, I'm a poor boy now. I'm born in southeastern Kentucky. Born and raised on cornbread, you know? And, uh, these city boys think they can slap a pair of Wrangler jeans and buy them a pair of Justins and then squat they truck and she's too dead. Like, you look like you're having a wrist spasm, too dead. She, like, no, you ain't too dead, Bubby. You retarded. There's a difference. You can pack a fatter dip than me, Bubby. Well, that's good. I tell you what, you do good, Bubby, if you pack fatter dip. You know what? Because I don't care. You know why? Because it ain't about the clothes. It ain't about your truck. It ain't about who listens to more music, who listens to better music. If you want to drive around listening to your Dan and Shay, you do that, but don't go around telling people you it's country as cornbread now, Bubby. Because I hate to tell you, but if you was born under mama's titty, sucking on mama's titty, born up in the city of fucking Chicago, you ain't country, Bobby. You a wannabe. <laughs> you know the back roads of your hometown better than you know the roads of the city? If you can, uh, if you can get your truck muddy, if you can fucking wear out a pair of boots in a little of no time if you can rope a cow if you can ride a bull if you do anything that we can agree on one thing and that one thing we can agree on is that we don't like you motherfuckers out in the city that think they country just cause they can put on a pair of blue jeans and a pair of Justin boots and drive around in a squad truck listening to the Dan Shay and that's by god the goddamn truth and I'll tell you what son I live by that standard my whole fucking life but I just think I just thought I'd address this on Ubis Tubis on my channel with seven point four five thousand something like that. Almost to ten thousand boys. Hell yeah. Let's hit that milestone of ten thousand. I will enjoy it. But I hope y'all do have a great day and a blessed day. And I hope you remember. Hope y'all have a blessed day, fucking. Hell yeah.